always tracking, always alerting. This is Storm Team 8. Well, this has been a cool and windy year so far. The month of April through today, 3.4 degrees cooler than average. And if you go all the way back to January 1st, uh, this year so far is 2.3 degrees cooler than average. And that's a pretty substantial amount of uh, temperature difference between uh, what we've had and average here. Uh, since December 1st, we've had 12 days and we've had wind gusts over 40 miles an hour here. So it certainly has been uh, a winter that we've had some pretty windy conditions from time to time. Nothing going on right now in our area, but here's the precipitation off to our west. And a lot of this is in the color blue, which indicates there's snow out here. As the system comes in our direction, we're going to see that snow develop across the area. Uh, we've moved the clock ahead now to 3 in the morning. Still not doing much of anything here at 3, but you can see the precipitation kind of spreads in the area. And by around 8 o'clock or so, it's snowing just about everywhere. And that's a little bit darker blue, so this is not going to be just a few flurries. This will be enough snow that will start accumulating on the grassy areas, though I think most of this melts on the area roads as warm as it was today with the sunshine and uh, the friction of the car tires and whatnot tomorrow. By the time we hit the uh, noon hour here, uh, precipitation south and uh, west of Grand Rapids is already turning over to rain because temperatures are warming up a little bit. And we'll see a few of these rain showers come through here during the afternoon hours. Then it goes back to a few snow flurries for tomorrow night and during the morning hours on Tuesday before finally the clouds start to break up here. And you can see we've got some sunshine coming our way here for late Tuesday afternoon. In terms of how much snow to expect, not a lot. Most areas will see uh, two inches or less actual fall and not as much uh, accumulating, some of that melding on contact, but it's certainly going to look wintry out there. And Much of the day temperatures will only be in the 30s. We do have a winter weather advisory in effect for the thumb area. This is an area that expects three to six inches of new snow. So any areas north of Detroit, that's Oakland, Macomb County, up to St. Clair County, uh, make sure that uh, if you're heading in that direction, you plan on uh, taking a little extra time because uh, that uh, snow will be coming down a little harder there. Uh, we're down into the uh, upper 20s to low 30s in inland areas come early tomorrow morning. And then high temperatures here tomorrow are generally only in the mid to upper 30s north of Grand Rapids. Around Grand Rapids, we may close in on 40 by late in the day. And to the south, I think temperatures hit the low 40s from I-94 off to the south. There's a look at your forecast. Temperatures slowly warm up, 46 Tuesday, 50 Wednesday. Finally, we get back to 60, which is normal here for Thursday. Uh, we get a mix of precipitation tomorrow, snow and then rain, a few flurries Tuesday morning. Rain late Wednesday into Wednesday night, and that'll be rain, not snow, and then dry weather here Thursday. Weekend looks good Saturday, dry and 75. Excited for that 75 and sunny. Do you think this is the last of the snow? I hope so. Looking forward to it. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Bill.